Hey, what's going on YouTube? Just another quick video. Just picked up this Google Chromecast from my local Best Buy for $35. You can also pick it up at any store for $35. Um, Target, Walmart, Best Buy, the total was $37.81 with taxes. The reason why I picked this up today is because a lot of the viewers do not have a Samsung phone and they want to screen mirror to their TV. They do not have the smart view option and they don't have any screen mirroring option on the phone. So one way to do it is to buy this Google Chromecast and to download the Google Home app. And I will show you guys that today. So we're going to do a quick unboxing. We're going to read the box real quick. And then we are going to uh, download the Google Home app. I already have it, but we're going to go through the settings. And I will show you guys that it is possible to screen mirror with any other brand phone that is not a Samsung, like an LG um, and any other phones that... Um, do not have smart view like the Samsung's, like the Samsung phones. All right, so the side of it, 1080p support, plug into your HDMI TV port, simple setup with the Google Home app. Let's see, I don't think you guys can see it. Stream from thousands of Android and iPhone apps, mirror your Android screen or laptop to your TV. So that's what we are going to try today. Um, the back says, bunch of stuff and then it says let's see anyone at home can cast to the TV using Android iPhone and laptops with Chrome uh, with Google Home just say what you want to watch to start streaming from compatible apps I'm reading this uh, backwards because I'm trying to show the camera let's see and then the other side uh, has some more stuff it says that it is compatible with iPhones you can cast um, I will hopefully get an iPhone soon so I can start doing some videos with the, not, with the iPhone. But there are a lot of videos on YouTube already that, um, that, that have an uh, iPhone screen mirroring. So you can also check those out. So let's uh, unbox this. Very small, have your HDMI. This side has a button here. And then it has a micro, looks like a micro USB uh, plug. Your power cable. Micro USB power cable and your power adapter and it tells you how to get started so I'm not going to go through the steps of plugging this into your TV very simple plug this into your HDMI port plug in the power and then power it up on your TV All right, so we are going to try to set up this Google Chromecast. We are going to download the Google Home app, and I'm going to show you guys what it looks like. It looks like a little home, and it says Google Home, so when you type that in there, that's what it's going to look like. And when it's with the rest of your apps, it's going to look like a little house, and it's going to say Home. Now, you do want to have your Wi-Fi on because it's going to look for this device. We're going to click on Home, Google Home. And then we are going to click on add, set up device, set up new devices in your home. That's the one we're going to click on, the first one. I'm just going to leave it as it says, home, location access, next. I'm going to allow and it's starting to look for devices. Okay, Chromecast found. Would you like to set up Chromecast 2479? I sure would. 
and now it's setting it up. So um, this step is going to show on the screen N5, A4, and if it's the same thing, you're just going to click yes. I'm not at the moment. We're going to click no. Where is this device? We're going to put bedroom next. And that's going to be bedroom one. Continue. Connect to Wi-Fi. We're going to have the Chromecast connect to, to that Wi-Fi. So the Chromecast right now is doing a update. put no thanks all done continue so it is updating the device I am at 72 percent all right so now that the Chromecast has updated something cool so if you click on bedroom one the TV we set up you can change what pictures but if you click on personalize ambient you can do a Google photo slideshow art gallery you can um, have it show the weather the time so it's pretty cool but the reason why we bought a Chromecast right was to screen mirror to it so what we are going to do is we are on the bottom all the way to the right in your account you're gonna scroll down and where it says additional you're going to see where it says mirror device if you click on that it's gonna tell you to cast to your device when you click on that your phone will be casted onto well you'll be screen mirroring onto your display so that's what we wanted so if you don't have I'll show you on my phone if you don't have where it says smart view like all the Samsung's phones do and there's no way for you to screen mirror you can purchase a Chromecast and screen mirror to any TV pretty much you plug your uh, Chromecast to it all right so this is what it's gonna look like you'll see here on the right hand side it says bedroom one and then the Wi-Fi network you're connected to and on the bottom it's gonna say the time I have this tablet here we're gonna go into Google Home and we're gonna try it with the tablet now all the way to the right under account so we're gonna go where it says additional mirror device Remember I had mine set up at bedroom one. We're going to click on that. And now we are screen mirroring. Let me go home. And you, now you can see that the Chromecast worked on my cell phone and on this tablet. Now the next mission is getting a hold of an iPad or iPhone. And then we, we are going to try it again. So if this video has helped you out, please smash that like button. Consider subscribing. It really helps me out. And thanks for watching.